Richard Southern is back again. We're chatting about some of the day's more interesting stories. And Richard, we've been kind of geeking out all day because NASA's Webb telescope continues to amaze us all. Yeah, we had the first picture from the telescope yesterday. Now there's a few more that have been released, Erica. This is the most powerful telescope ever that is sitting in between the sun and the Earth. So let's take a look at some of the images that came out today. Wow. This is Stefan's Quintet, they call it. Yeah, wow, indeed. These are five galaxies, Erica. This is uh, 290 million light years from Earth. It's the largest image yet taken by the telescope. Four of the five galaxies engaged in a deadly game of chickens swooping past one another until one day they'll merge. The galaxy at the top harbors a supermassive black hole. You can see the images swirling around, and this is a, uh, an image of new stars being born inside that big cloud. Pretty cool stuff, Erica. Yeah, so uh, you're, we're scrolling through some of the images now, but uh, you saw there um, the cosmic cliffs of the Carina Nebula. Um, that was that previous image there, and it's basically where these little baby stars are born, and all that dust is sort of the raw stuff that makes um, stars and planets and galaxies. It's amazing, and there was another one that's what you're looking at right now is a dying star and it's just these exploding, it's an exploding cloud of gas that's kind of emulating from the center of that um, dying star there. It's really, really cool and it's astonishing to think that these are real things that are out there that we haven't seen before. Really is astonishing indeed. Finally, there's one uh, that it isn't a picture at all. We saw it go by there. It's actually highlights another feature of the telescope spectrometry. They can look at light coming from a planet, analyze what the light is. And in this particular case, they looked at a big gas giant 1100 light years from here and they found some water and they found some clouds as well. So pretty yeah. wild stuff. Here. Water's a big thing, right? Okay. Um, moving along, Kanye West, we're switching gears a bit, <laughs> continues his side hustle and <laughs> footwear from stars to Kanye West. West yeah. Uh, but his latest creation uh, isn't exactly drawing rave reviews, Richard. Well, he is, he is a star of a different kind, I mm -hmm. suppose, Erica. Uh, yeah, I know he's big into sneakers, and his latest ones aren't really <laughs> drawing rave okay. reviews. Look at these things. Okay? <laughs> it looks like pizza dough. <laughs> yeah, that's what they're saying. These are the new Yeezys, 260 bucks for these. People online having a field day commenting on them. They think they look like bread. This one user on Twitter says, quote, I feel as though they need to go back in the oven for another 20 minutes. They haven't risen yet. Another user <laughs> said, another user said, quote, what are they filled with? Beef and onion or chicken or mushroom? <laughs> And uh, Dale, uh, a Twitter user, said, quote, these are generally the worst footwear I've ever seen. You've released some horrid stuff, but this takes the biscuit. Yeah, Kanye's like, it's fashion, look it up, okay? People just need to get on board. <laughs> he's still gonna sell, you know he's gonna sell a million of them anyway. All right, uh, most cities are trying to get rid of drug dealers, not honor them, but things are a little different <laughs> down in Albuquerque, New Mexico, Richard. Albuquerque, they're rushing to put up statues of drug dealers, at least ones on the TV. This is uh, uh, from Breaking Bad. They're going to put up a statue of, of uh, Walter White and Jesse Pinkman in Albuquerque, where that show was set. Uh, the, the show, uh, the city said, listen, we want to honor these guys because it's meant so much tourism-wise to our city. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's pretty wild, even though they are supposed to drug dealers. Erica, I want to show you. I petitioned the city of Toronto to put up oh, some goodness. statues here. I was, I was rejected, but... I really wanted them to put this up downtown. <laughs> Nobody wants that. I don't know. I don't think anybody wants that in downtown they, they Toronto. Were, they, were, they, were thinking, they were thinking about that one. This next one, though, they swiftly rejected. I wanted this at Young Dundas Square. Uh, <laughs> I thought it would look good. You're looking good. You're looking stacked there, Richard. Thanks. It's called I've been stacked. Working and, out. Been yeah. Working out. You yeah. Know, chiseled. Yeah. The lockdown has been good to you, I guess. <laughs> okay. Been good to me. Anyways, <laughs> rejected statues. Maybe I'll try again next year. Okay, maybe. So we'll see you, see you tomorrow, Richard. Thank you.